Hello guys, um, this is going to be a video log, vlog, if you will, of me um, recording an audiobook session that I'm doing. It's an audio, it's an audiobook story that I have written myself, um, and it. Some of you may or may not know I am a huge uh, proponent of um, Warhammer 40,000 audiobooks. In particular, there's one writer I like, uh, Darren Dembski Bowden. I love his uh, story arcs concerning Feebless Bile and a whole bunch of other various stories he's done um, Talon of Horus, uh, the, the Black Legion, things of that nature. And. Um, I decided to write a story very similar to that, and this is a fan-made story. This has nothing to do with the Warhammer, actual Warhammer universe, or any of the characters mentioned within. They are IPs belonging to Games Workshop. This is just a story that I have come up with. So when I mention characters like Fibulous Bile, um, when I mention characters like... Um, uh, Reboot Gilliman, um, those are IPs belonging solely to Games Workshop. When I mention characters that I have created, they are mine, i.e. the planet Ritheria is mine, um, the name of the Space Marines chapter is mine, which is the Atlantean Spears, um, the, the, the Strike Cruiser's name is mine, which is Dawn's Resilience, that is mine, um, the, the the space marine captain's name agent uh, the captain uh agent strike she uh, ironically is an actual uh, character i play as in uh, 40k's boarding action um she's actually a miniature i 3d printed uh so i figured it'd be good to give her a little nod a little tip of the hat uh to uh my 3d printed companies and uh, and whatnot so uh please understand and uh sit back uh these are this video series is, is a uh, experiment for me. Uh, so if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you like the story or uh, where the story is going, um, bear in mind this is a quick story. This isn't like a thirty-minute to forty-five-minute listen for the entire book. Um, and this book is designed for you to use your imagination. Um, so without further ado, uh, I will be editing the actual video you're seeing here. The audio itself will be separate um, so you will be hearing me make audio mistakes here in the video but if you want to download the actual audiobook itself uh, I will make it available from a Google Dropbox um, and I will post a link in the video description um, so without further to do uh, let's get into it <clears throat> Oh, that's going to be annoying, this fucking chair squeaking. You know what, let me swap out the different chair. Oh god, you, sh you make even more noise. One, when you are doing audiobook recording, you need to be comfortable. Um, I have this fan on a low setting. I've done some audio test settings, and you can't hear it. So, uh, that's good. Uh, and if need be, there are some filters you can run through uh, to help reduce it. Uh, but you want to reduce as much background noise as you can. So, computer fans, um, put your phone on airplane mode. Uh, or if you're using your phone to record... Um, you know, record it while in airplane mode, which you can do, uh, things of that nature. So let me just scratch that. <clears throat> Shh. 
Shadows of the Altered Stars A fan fade Cut, edit here Shadow of the Altered Stars A fan fade Fan favourite, fan favourite, fan made, fan made Edit here Shadow of the Altered Stars A fan made story in the 41st millennium. Writer, Danny Monaghan. Narrator, Danny Monaghan. Chapter 1 Echoes of the Past. High above a desolate world of Rutheria, the Castellan Stellaris Morn stood upon the observation deck of the Atlantean Spears strike cruiser, the Dawn's Resilience. His gaze fixed on an inky expanse of space lost in contemplation. Then suddenly a flicker of light danced on the edge of his vision. A faint distress signal and the origin of a shrouded in mystery. As he presses the buttons he notices that the imperial codes of this distress signal are old but still valid. Very old but still valid. He orders the strike cruiser to alter its course, the engines thrumming in anticipation as the Atlantean spears approach the signal source. A vast derelict vessel drifting into view, its once mighty form now a husk of forgotten battles. Captain Aegeus Drake, her fiery red hair framing her determined expression, ordered a boarding action. Castilian Solaris Moran stops for a moment before maglocking his bolt pistol. He turns, looks at the captain and thinks to himself, I must ask her about that scar on her face. He dons his helmet, orders his men to action. The boarding teams draw, join the point edit here. The boarding team consisting of a tech priest, an apothecary, and several other space marines. Point edit here. And several other space marines. Join. Point edit here. Join Castilian Solaris Moraine as they enter the Thunderhawk gate. Point edit here. As they enter the Thunderhawk gunship. Its engines roar to life as the pilot takes off. A few moments later, they land. Navigating through the dimly lit corridors, their footsteps echoing in the silence. In the heart of the vessel, they discover a chamber, a glow with ethereal light. A holographic recording flickers to life, revealing a chapter believed lost, the Omega Guardians. Their leader, enigmatic band, Arlek Streso, steps forth. His presence commanding attention. End of chapter one. So guys, that's just a quick breakdown summary of how I'm going to do chapter one. Um, if you're interested in this story, please let me know and I will continue to do videos like this. I just wanted to do a quick what's it like to do video recordings because some of you guys may or may not know. I used to do... Uh, audio acting voice acting um some of the characters i've voice acted um they're, they're somewhat famous however because i wasn't part of sag because i wasn't part of um whatnot certain actors guilds or whatnot i didn't get credit um most notably i've done the voice for cobra commander you know and and various other um characters and whatnot um so yeah um if you are interested in also the editing process, I will add it on in the next video. You just let me know, guys, and uh, we will go from here. Uh, so, yeah, guys, like I said, please give the video a like. I greatly appreciate it. If you're new around here, give it a subscribe. And uh, I will see you, hopefully, in the next part, if you like it. Uh, again, but please do not, not, do not be afraid to comment, 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 comment. Okay, even if you like it, even if you don't. Okay, I want to start doing some more um, 
content like this. I know it's a short video, but uh, I'm, I'm realizing I think I would get better viewers and retention and whatnot if I did videos under 20 minutes or under 15 in this case. And uh, so, yeah, guys, until then, I will see you in the next one. Ciao.